Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the types of attributes guys. So there are two types of attributes, synthesized attribute and inherited attributes guys. Okay, so synthesized attribute. So basically inherited, you will be having an idea that some from parents or somewhere you'll be getting, right? Yes, exactly. You are correct up to some part. There is some more addition to it. Okay, so first let us go to synthesized attributes. So if a node takes a value from its children, then it is called as synthesized attribute from children. Okay, so example, A implies B, C, D. Okay, synthesized means from children. Okay, so here the value of A if it is depending on a B or a C or a D or any kind of combination, then we call it as synthesized attribute. So synthesized attribute will depend on its children. Remember that. That's it. Okay. Yes. So similarly, inherited attribute. So inherited attribute, everyone will be saying that parent. So along with the parent, there is one more thing. So along with the parent, it can take the values from its siblings also. So A, B, C, D values can be dependent directly on A or if you are calculating values of B, the value of B can depend on A or B or C or any combination. So that is nothing but inherited attribute. So if a node takes value from its parent or sibling, so B dot S is equals to A dot S, C dot S is equals to B dot S, D dot S is equals to B dot S plus C dot S, C dot S is equals to A dot S. Okay. So in this way, so basically from parents or siblings. Okay. Whereas in, in, in synthesized only from its children is called as synthesized. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on the types of attributes. So in the next lecture, we'll be going through the types of STD that is nothing but S attributed and L attributed. Okay. So let us meet in the next lecture. Thank you. Thanks for watching.